Hey, welcome back to the Lana Random Rick Reviews. Today we're going to take a look at Retro Wave. It's a cheap game off Steam, of course. Uh, it's under a dollar. So, this is a Retro Endless Racer. Some pretty cool options though. It's definitely an 80s vibe. Uh, made by... Developer Rewind App. Came out March 6, 2020. So that's pretty new. So, uh, got some options here. Select car. So you start out with this car. Looks like a DeLorean. I went ahead and upgraded to this car. It's not really upgraded, by different cars. I think this is upgraded, so we yeah, quite a bit. And you can add tires. I added a new engine, better steering. You can paint it. Select car. Next. You got one way endless. You got rainy night, summer night. A couple aren't open yet. Let's do a summer night. So at the bottom it's got like a tracking <laughs> um, image I guess from the little VHS days. Hit Y to change views. Um, third person. Side and top down like a cell phone game. I uh, prefer this view. Uh, up on the joystick. Back on the joystick to break. It's a cool synthesizer music. Way scores, the ones don't hit anything, and the increase score is like near misses. I would forgive you for side swiping, you just can't like hit things like uh, dead on at uh, the end of the, end of the game. Uh, it's high scores because, like I said, it's an endless run. So, hit the back of that. Uh, let's look at something else. I'm gonna get a short review. The game's fun. Um, let's show you some other cars. So, let's show that. It looks like a pretty. No, it's all there. It's MR2, but it's not Camaro. <laughs> XR7, it's a RX7. It's um, Stingray. Testarossa. Force 911. Kuntosh uh, Lamborghini. Whatever that is, got a boost car, got a DeLorean, and a uh, F40, right? I believe. Let's go next. Uh, so we got <clears throat> one way, two way, time attack, speed bomb. Let's go off into the sunset for the last one. Alright, that's pretty cool. Okay. I like this view, I think, the best. So it's simple. Just don't hit anything or the game's over. Uh, you got your speed, your distance, and your high speed over there. And then you earn money to unlock um, upgrades or different cars. So, I think they nailed everything they were going for in this game. Uh, Strive to have neon lights, palm trees, synth wave, 80 super scars, through now the endless highway. Welcome to the world of retro wave. I'm going two waves. Let's go back. Right. So we'll do uh, New Cyber City. <laughs> short run and I'm back that's what a speed bomb means check it out so rainy night 
It's pretty chill. And of course, the uh, longer it goes, the harder it gets. But if you're a fan of uh, retro 80s stuff, it's pretty cool. Like for like a dollar, it's definitely worth it. We got some combos going here. It's a little hard to see because the, the blue of the lights. So there's Retro Wave. I think it's pretty good. It's worth a pick up. And we'll go into the good and the bad. I don't see much bad, really. All right, let's go over the good. Fun gameplay, great music, good graphics, good amount of options, and it's cheap. So it's all good things. I really don't have anything bad to say, so there'll be no uh, bad. Okay, final rating is 9.5 out of 10. Couldn't really find too much wrong with this game. Uh, only gripe I kind of maybe maybe could say is like the control scheme. Uh, you can't change it. So I guess that could be something that kind of keeps it from the 10 out of 10. But really good game. <laughs>